Dominican, we are about truth, compassion, justice, community, and partnership. When we were selecting a school for the kids, uh, my wife and I had already decided we wanted a Catholic education. But more than that, we wanted something that we knew our kids would excel in. So we came here with our son the first time, and it was the first school that we looked at. By the end of that day, uh, our son said, this is where I want to go, this is the place. And it's really about the sense of belonging, the sense of family that he got immediately. We provide an education to a diverse group of students and these students are going to change the world. They work together, they're community members, they're service-minded, and they know that um, from a faith base they can achieve whatever they need to. There are very few opportunities to have quality Catholic education. Uh, that's delivered in a co-educational environment. That's welcoming, that's diverse, uh, that is open to all, uh, that introduces parents and families and students to cultures and backgrounds that they may not be a part of. The spirit and atmosphere here at Dominican is all about community and family involvement. I'm not an alum of Dominican, but my son has been so involved in Dominican. I honestly feel my alma mater is blue and gold, but I'm telling you I'm bleeding green because of the, the community and the involvement of Dominican. So when you walk in the door, you, you, feel that family, you feel that family atmosphere. It seems that the kids here uh, seem to have the feeling they really belong to something. Academically, this is a very strong school, and the kids get a Christian value system. That's an accomplishment for a school. The teachers see the students as individuals and that there's more than just subject matter. That, that it's important to learn to know the students, see uh, where they need help, where their strengths are, and to develop the entire student rather than just to worry about just subject matter. They push us, and they're not just pushing us for the sole reason of them being teachers and us being the students. They truly want the best out of us, and I feel that in the classroom. I feel like the faculty and staff has really prepared me very well to take that next step forward, going to college, going to Notre Dame next year, and I feel much more prepared than I could have ever imagined. If you need help, they're always here after school, during lunch, and even early in the morning. Every day at Dominican, you learn something new, no matter what it is, in the classroom, out the classroom. So I think just knowing that I'm gonna learn something new every day, every morning, I think that's a big reason why I wake up. For me, I think a real strength of Dominican is that it um, appeals to and, and, and gives opportunity to kids who really have many different gifts. So if it's a matter that it's theater, if it's a matter of um, academic, it's a matter of sports, um, no matter what it may be that you can find your niche. We are a strong academic school. We know uh, how to prepare the students uh, to become critical thinkers, these lifelong skills they're going to need. We know how to uh, prepare them to be uh, not only responsible, uh, members of the community, but also active members of our community. We need to make sure that our facilities mirror the academic excellence that we provide on a daily basis. Some of the needs we have aren't glamorous, but they are definitely required for us to upgrade our building. This includes a boiler, it includes ADA accessibility, bathrooms on our first floor, and tuck pointing to our exterior. It's been around for a long time and people zip by it on Silver Spring. And we need to make it stand out a little bit more. The entryway is awkward. You know, people don't know where to come in when they're visiting. I think we could make it so much more appealing so when people enter, they sense the great things that are going on at Dominican. And unfortunately, with an older building and a dated 
entrance and office area, you don't get that sense. And there are so many great things going on here. Dominican has a fabulous theater program. The musicals and plays are second to none. I think we should be renovating or looking to renovate our auditorium and make it a showcase for the school and also make it a place where our students can gather for mass, assemblies, or different events and be proud. The cafeteria provides an opportunity for students to have a place to come before school, after school, and a true student commons where they can come together and bring their laptops in, do their homework, maybe get a coffee, provide an area that they feel comfortable in and want to spend time here. Dominican has a, a unique group of students. It, about 50% of the students require some type of financial aid. Having a strong endowment uh, where there is some certainty to the availability of scholarship funds to assure more students that are well qualified academically but maybe don't have the money uh, to pay for a Dominican education can come here. Uh, so an endowment is a uh, great way to help stabilize that offering to make sure any child who has the desire and capability to participate here can participate. I know that there are many families that need assistance with the tuition for the school. And I think it's very important that we try to give them a little boost if we can. To anyone that's been touched by Dominican, I believe that the investment in the school is well worth the time, effort, and funds. Dominican is a key point to this portion of the community. It provides an, a great education, it provides parental involvement, it provides core values that children can live to grow into productive citizens. I believe that's worth investing in. We've gone through three generations now of our kids being affiliated with Dominican, our kids and grandkids. And I think that if we want to preserve that opportunity for other people and for our future generations, that it, you know, it's important that we pay attention to making the investment back into an institution which we value uh, you know, for what it's contributed to our family over the years. An investment in Dominican is really an investment in the future because these are the people who are really going to go out into this world, a very diverse um, world, a world that really is in need of of healing, a world um, that is divided in many ways, and I, I think that these are the kids who are going to really be able to uh, be those leaders in the future and are really going to be able to make this world a better place to live. Now's the time because there is a, a bit of a revival at, at Dominican. Enrollment is on the upswing, there's quality athletics, there's quality academics, and to be part of something great in the long run, now's the time to jump on board. Every dollar that goes into Dominican will make a difference in the future, and these kids deserve this education. It, it doesn't just stop here. Our students are making a difference today, and they will definitely make a difference tomorrow. Now is the time, it's Dominican's time, to make our vision a reality.